Hey, 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 one minute at the car shocker. My name is Jimmy Prater. I'm a car closer. That's what I am. I close and close and close. I close car deals. I close them. I grow some bastard brains out. That's what you like to do too. But if you're trying to be like Amazon and you're a car dealership, it's not happening. It's not happening. I'm going to tell you why it's not happening. You are not Amazon. You are a car dealership. People buy from you that are in a 13-mile radius. 13-mile radius. Who gives a shit about a bounce rate? The only thing that are bouncing are your customers outside your showroom because you're not closing a car deal. You're not paying attention to what's the most important thing in your dealership, and that's your salespeople. Salespeople are the backbone of the industry. Closers, salespeople, you guys are the ones that make things happen for the dealership. Without you, they have shit. Amazon? You're not an Amazon store. Will it ever be that? Hell no. It will never be that. It will never, ever be like Amazon when buying a car. First of all, you have regulations, state and federal. In most states, the salespeople are licensed. Now, salespeople, you're street smart. Let's, let's, get in, let's get involved here. You're street smart. Don't drink their Kool-Aid. It's not going down. I mean, they want to throw out all these fancy terminology from the Internet Department. Who gives a shit about the Internet Department? We want to close the damn car deal right now. The only thing you should be engaging is your own personal smartphone. Engage your smartphone. That's the only way you're going to make a little bit more traffic for your store for every single salesperson to engage on their smartphone. We don't care about how many clicks you got. We don't care how many leads you got because it's all bullshit. What we care about is making money. That's all we care about. Dealers, listen. You will never be Amazon. Despite what NADA says or any of these stupid conventions, you will never be Amazon. Dealers, I got something for you. The people that are pitching you these ideas... Look at them. Judge them. Ask them to get on the damn floor. Ask them to try to close a car deal. If they can't close a car deal right in front of you, kick their ass out of your dealership. If they come in and pitch you about data security, data security, data freaking security, how is that going to sell you more cars? That's wasting your time. Everybody's got security now, right? It's just everywhere. It's not a big deal. But they're wasting your time selling you paper clicks. They're wasting your time talking about data security. They're wasting your time telling you you're going to be the next Amazon. And they're going to lead you down that path. The only thing they're going to lead you down the path is the path of a fairy tale because you're going to be spending a lot of money. You don't want to spend the money on these fools. They're worse than pot of sugar trainers. They're worse than snake oil salespeople. You know what they are? They're criminals. They're stealing your money. Because the most important thing right now is closing a damn car deal that's right here time now. Every single person that's on your floor ought to be an assassin. Every single salesperson closer ought to be an assassin and go for the juggler. Gut the customer like a deer. Pull their guts out and piss all over them. That's all you got to do. Hey, if you're a customer watching this, you're like, I, that's why I don't like car salesmen. I don't give a shit. And guess what? Real salespeople, real closers don't give a shit about you either. We're going to gouge your freaking eyeballs out of your skull. We're going to punch your lights out. We're going to steal your money out of your bank account. That's who we are. But we're going to do it with a smile. We're going to do it with a smile. And you're going to love it. You're going to be violating, customer. And you're going to love it. Because we're going to make it easy on you. 
We're going to massage the deal so you're okay with it. Until you wake up in the morning, you got buyer's remorse. You know what that means? It means we did our job. Dealers, you got to listen up. You've got these morons running your stores, these general managers that are morons. You give them a little bit of a contract. It's a circus deal. It's a clown deal. Because you know what? Those guys will never, ever own the dealership. You will pretend and be phony about that they're going to own the store. They're never going to own the store. So let's just get back to reality. Let's get back closing car deals. This business hasn't changed in 100 years. You got a product, you got a customer, you beat the lights out of the customer, you take their money, you gouge them, and guess what? You go home and have a steak dinner. That's all there is to it. That's what we do. We gross car deals. Now get it back in, in, in your mind that that's what you got to do. Forget about all this other nonsense. It doesn't work. Look at it. It's not working. You're chasing your tail like a dog. Now, if you need some help closing in your damn car dealership, call the call, shocker. Just that's all you got to do. We come there. We'll show you. We'll get on the floor. We'll knock the lights out of customers. And guess what? We'll do it with a smile, too. And dealer, yes, we'll take your money, too. Because you're willing to give it away to criminals. Why don't you give it away to somebody that's actually going to make you some damn money? Because I'm an advocate for salespeople. The car shocker is an advocate for salespeople, and you are screwing them. Get rid of your damn packs, you freaking moron. If you like anything on this video at all, go ahead and like and share it if you don't. I say it all the time in every damn video. Put the damn thumbs down. Tell me what you think about me. Make me rage. I love it. Gives me feel. I want to close a car deal. I want to close a car deal. I want to gut a customer. Who don't want to gut a customer? Who don't want to make money? You got to want to make money. You got to have that customer in front of you. You got to be motivating. You got to have that sales process, the closing process. You got to have a finance process. And you got to make money. Now do yourself a favor. My name is Jimmy Prater. Go close something. Yeah!